Hey guys, Math Tutorials 14 here, and we're back with our tutorial. And so today, I'm going to be showing you guys how to get the library folder back on OSX MapMine. Okay, so um, if you're familiar with the library folder, um, what it used to let you do on Snow Leopard is it used to let you go into your bin in Minecraft and mod things and change things like that. And um, you can override things. Um, it's basically you go in a library and then you can choose application support. But for some reason, I have no idea why, in the newest update, well, not in the newest update, but in the newest version of the software, OSX Mountain Lion, not Snow Leopard, um, Apple actually decided for some reason to hide the library folder. So as you can see, normally it would, um, in Snow Leopard, it would library, the library folder would be right here. But for some reason, they just hit it. So um, they did not completely erase it. It is still there because they need it to be able to, you know, have all the files there. So what you have to do is if you want actual access to it, you have to go into Finder. And then at the top sidebar, you want to go into Go, Go to Folder. And this will be in the description box below. Um, so what you're going to want to do in the description below is copy and paste that code into here and hit go. And then you should be right here where it says slash user slash um, whatever your name is, then slash library. Um, so once again, um, this should happen. Um, let's just do that one more time. Just do that one more time. Go to folder. And then you want to make sure you have slash slash library right there. Just make it a little bit bigger. Sl um, not slash slash library. The um, a thing that's like an accent thing. And then the uh, for the backward slash. And then capital L I B A R Y. So you're gonna hit go, and then you are at the folder. And from here, you can just drag it onto your sidebar. And there's the library. So as you can see, you can go into application support. Um, and if you do have Minecraft and you like modding it, um, you need to access the bin and stuff like that to be able to do that. Um, so that is very useful there. And then um, for my tutorial for iDVD, you're going to need um, this code um, to be able to get into the library to overwrite that data. So make sure you did that. Um, so yeah guys, that's it for this video. Um, make sure I am going to be doing, um, that's going to come up really soon. Um, actually, I uh, have about a week and a week, a week and a half, two weeks um, left of school. So once school's over for me, I will be doing a top uh, t 10 to top 30 city of tweaks. I'm not sure what it's going to be. It's either going to be top 10 or top 30. Haven't made up the list yet, but I'm going to be doing that in the next few uh, days to weeks. Um, so yeah guys, that's it for this video. Uh, make sure you uh, smash that like button and smash that subscribe button because I need I need more subscribers and more likes and more comments. I really do because a lot of my videos, um, this is probably going to be one of my popular videos like the iDVD one and um, my, uh, my jailbreak tutorial one. But definitely guys, check out my other videos, the ones that aren't as successful like um, to uh, tell you guys I just put up last night on my channel, I just put up uh, I was at a bot, and that's fun. I just put up um, the Harlem Shake. Um, not that that's, it's only like 15 seconds long, but um, make sure you, do, you guys do check that out because I think it's really cool and I think you guys would like it. Check out my other videos. So that's it for this video, guys. And I guess for now, I will talk to you guys later.